Hey guys, it's Trip Pal from Coosa Country Club. I'm just going to go over um, today's video lesson about head covers <clears throat> and how we can use them in our practice sessions. Um, <clears throat> there's a couple different ways you can use them. As you can see right there, well, I put it under my lead arm, and that's for uh, typically for the people that kind of swing from inside to out. <clears throat> um, it kind of drags that club back to the inside, I guess. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Um, watching it in slow motion here. Kind of brings, makes you bring that left arm in for those people that kind of, you know, get it separated and kind of chicken wing it or go outward. You know, their swing path comes maybe from there to there. Um, it kind of drags it and brings it more this way, um, which will help them out getting your swing going down the line or down your target line. Um, a different way, uh, a lot of people kind of take take it way back on the on the back swing and have too much of a back swing, too long. Um, kind of helps you keep it inside, keep your arms tight to your body because the, the less movement we have with our, with our arms, you know, and we use our big muscles like our body and our hips um, and keeping our arms pretty tight to our sides, that, uh, <clears throat> that helps us, um, that helps us uh, gain consistency and just adds another, or, you know, takes away another variable of your arms moving up and down and then turning into it. Um, I found if you have both problems, if you need to have a, your arms tighter to your body at all times, two head covers work. You can put them under both sides, and that's a really good drill. <coughs> um, for for those who who swing inside to out and have a short backswing, like like uh, or have a long backswing, and are trying to get them trying to get uh, that backswing a little more tight and trying to bring that club face or club down the target line there. So um, <clears throat> let's show some from this side <clears throat> as well. And really when you do this one with the lead one, we're really trying to get you know that arm kind of <clears throat> almost like you're pulling that arm this way, like towards your left pocket, um, keep those hands uh, in front while coming to the left. Um, don't want you to swing over the top and flip it because then we'll be going backwards. But uh, on the other side here, <coughs> kind of prevents you from getting too long with those arms and really tightens it up so you can use your body. Um, that's a good good drill especially like for longer clubs like a driver or something that that you would tend to get long on um here's the two just kind of keeps everything together and really gets you rotating moving your body rotation is is key and that's really where we want to generate the power not from added like uh added arm speed but added body speed it's going to get you through the through the target, through the impact zone, down the target line, faster and more consistent than with the arms. So um, that's it. <clears throat> I'm Trip Powell. Call me for lessons and have a uh, happy holiday. <clears throat>